Strong winds last night toppled trees in several parts of the tri-state area. CBS News Elijah Westbrook has more on the damage and the cleanup. The corners got completely crushed and uh, knocked out the fence, the iron railing. So it's pretty, it's pretty good damage there. A powerful and fast-moving storm Monday night toppled this large tree into Bill Boschel's family's brownstone on Bay Ridge Parkway in Brooklyn. It snapped the trunk in half, forcing the long branches to crash to the roof, creating a terrifying night. It was scary because it was right against the door and it was on the roof, and it was like, oh my God. This is a big tree. Look at this tree. The images of downed trees is being seen all over our region. On Marion Avenue in the Fordham section of the Bronx, this tree here snapped in half and fell on power lines. It's a similar sight in Woodhaven, Queens. Across the Hudson, the wind was howled and then bada boom. Rich Hannafan and his wife Jill own this home in Cedar Grove, New Jersey. They tell us the fast storm aggressively powered through, causing a big tree to collapse right in front of their house. The couple says they're fine, including their dog, who was outside at the time. It started rain. I heard it pelting on the window. Then all of a sudden, it sounded like a uh, a train went through. When many residents woke up today, reality certainly kicked in right here in Bay Ridge. Boschel tells me that the city's parks department will pull that tree you see there off of the home, and a roofing company will come in and assess the damages and replace whatever needs to be fixed. Thank God nobody else was uh, hurt. Well, nobody was hurt in general. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Very lucky. Words Boschel and others say they can't emphasize enough. In Bay Ridge, Brooklyn, Elijah Westbrook, CBS 2 News.